just got to do some quick alterations actually to that open the table back up I want to get it back in design view I've got to do a couple of things so the postcode we click in there we want to format um, we want to turn it into the postcode so I input, input mask that's it and what you do is um, try and give it the postcode so it displays properly so that there say that's your postcode but you really want it like say you're doing one in London it's on W1 this is the thing I wanted and it won't work so what you have to do is suss out which numbers and letters go where so if I went W1 it's not having it straight away because it's expecting uh, a letter and you want a number so you go on to the next box let's just delete this whilst we can't move on next what we want is what we sussed out was if we type in L A 99 I'm sure you can do it we'll have that as our um, placeholder character try it so you have to get right at the beginning it's really awkward this is so we give it W1 that'll work look 3RE let's say that works so delete all them DN21 5ER that works you could have uh, YO12 5TY that works everything's going to work now so you, so you click next just ask you how you want to display it I'm going to have mine with a space and that's it and we've done our input mask yeah so that there is updated there's one for the house number as well input mask save the table right it's been saved so we'll do this one phone number 4445555 so if you did let's try um, that's not right is it for mobile it's just not right telephone number so let's see what happens next so what I've done is I've took five letters numbers sorry and then just move the bracket along so you can type a normal code in if you want and um, a number that'll do yeah so next that'll do ask you how you want it displayed code and then the number might as well that's it finish so now you've set up your table and the next thing we'll do is go and create a form